Not too many people have a job like Tech Sergeant Jeffrey Fay and Staff Sergeant Brandon Johnson. Who else on this base can say they, they get to go out and, uh, and fly a remote control airplane? And, uh, you know, just, just look for stuff around parts of Vandenberg that people never get to see. These airmen aren't just flying the Raven to check out the scenic Californian coast. They're using the Raven to ensure the safety zone for each launch is clear. We're looking for people out there. Maybe someone wandered out there doing some sightseeing or something. We're looking for those kinds of people. And we're also looking for anybody or any vehicle that's not supposed to be out there. We're going to find them and we're going to direct someone out there to check it out. With an operational radius of six miles, the Raven UAV proves to be an effective surveillance tool for Vandenberg's unique landscape. The terrain here is pretty rough, so even ATVs can't get through a lot of the thick brush around here, and there's a lot of area to cover, so if we can get up in the air, we can cover the amount of ground that someone could cover, and it could take them a couple days to cover. The Raven team has put in countless hours to ensure the safety, security, and reliability of operations before and after each launch. But it's well worth it for the stunning views of the base. We get to see it from an aerial view, and we get to, uh, to see all aspects of this entire installation. It's, it's a great job. Staff Sergeant George Solis, Vandenberg Air Force Base, California.